Candace and say hi, bad boy. Thank you. Yeah. We are um, going to do a quick video today. Um, we got some packages in the post yesterday and today, but Bubby here has been really, really sick for a couple of days, and we had to take him to the vet yesterday, and he seems to be doing a little better today. He just can't get over whatever this stomach thing is that he and Mahoney have had for a month and a half. And say, Dr. Price, that's one of Padfoot's numerous girlfriends, she she considered, you know, it, it might be some sort of her defined parasite. I can't remember which kind it was, or even Giardia, or whatever you call that. But she said she really thinks that's slim to none, even then, because if it was either one of those, he would have been much sicker, and he's still eating and playing when he's not having these attacks. It, she thinks because they have sensitive stomach issues that, you know, it's a flare-up, and it's something we've struggled with for a few years, and nosy Rosie, and it's something we'll just have to keep dealing with, huh? But it's so scary when he's sick, and he is a bit of a whiner, but not like how it was day before yesterday. He was just laying, oh, laying on the bed next to me crying, and I couldn't do anything to help him, and it just, it broke my heart. But, say, he's on antibiotics and some nausea medication, and a bland, icky diet. And say tomorrow, Mom is going to make him some chicken and rice. He loves that. So, we're going to get you better, huh, Boo Bear? <laughs> so, um, we're going to do a quick unboxing. Probably do this in two parts because one of the items that came today is missing a piece. And I had to write them a nasty message on eBay because their, their product description was very misleading. And... I needed to make this video, so I'll get to that in a minute, but, <coughs> um, the first thing that came yesterday, which is part of going to be, our part of what's going to be helping me ma make new videos when, once I get everything, but I got a 32 gigabyte, um, micro SD card and it came with the adapter in the case as well as this little this little drive and it's got a slot in the bottom and I didn't understand it at first and I kept I thought this was a regular flash drive and I kept trying to get it to work and it just wouldn't work and I was just all up in arms after having a very bad day yesterday dealing with the sick blubby and going to the vet, not having slept the night before, worrying about him. So I was a little flustered that I couldn't get this to work. And then I, it just hit me, I realized, after messing with it for forever, that little slots for the SD card. I've never seen them like that before, but pretty neat. So I am I got that for, see, I've got this phone. This is my regular uh, Samsung Galaxy Mini, but... I also have another one just like it in black. And since this is my, my regular phone, um, I, I used to have two lines, but it's just too expensive to keep both. Um, so since I don't use this one as a phone, it's just back up if I break that one, which just a matter of time before I do, because I am just clumsy as hell. But um, <clears throat> this one I'm going to use as backup, but in, if that one breaks, but... In the meantime, since these, these two phones, they have incredible video quality. So I decided I'd get a memory card and a tripod stand for this. And we're going to see about using these to make my videos from now on. So that that's what the memory card was for. But the adapter and the little blue flash drive, that was extra. And that's all that right there was, I think, like $750 on eBay. So then the second part of that helped me make my videos 
came today, and what I'm all up in arms about is that the product isn't what it was described to be. This is a a tripod for cell phones, ah. and it this one's pretty cool. I didn't realize it till I opened it, but you can bend it any way you want. But can we see what the problem is with this? It's missing the the bracket, the little phone holder. And the way the description read on the title um, and the description of the product was that it was the tripod and the mount. And all I got was a freaking tripod. And so if they didn't do something about it, I'm going to end up having to buy the other piece. And that really miffs me off. But whatever. After the week from hell I've had, and it's only Wednesday, but uh, this week just has not gone right yet. So I got another package, and I can tell from feeling it what's in it. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm I'm coming down with bronchitis, pleurisy, and pneumonia. I get that once or twice a year, and it's either once in the spring. Or once on Christmas Eve, and I had it this time around this time last year, so I kind of figured it would come back. So you get for having really bad asthma and allergies and living in living in Atlanta where the pollen count is just obnoxiously high, and it's just it's getting to me. All right, <clears throat> this is a twenty-five foot audio cable with the uh, male and female ends. <clears throat> Just a cord I need. I have one in the bedroom that it runs from a another cable to my uh, alarm clock, but I don't use it as an alarm clock. I use it as just for the speakers for my laptop and tablet. So I just need one of those because um, this end that I plug into the laptop, it was fraying and half the copper wire was hanging out and so I can't get sound so yay for that got another package well, I don't have it together I'm very sick and I'm weak and my mind is just still all in a million places. Tap what really scared the hell out of mama. Alright, so these are refurbished um printer ink cartridges for my HP printer. I don't know how it'll work, but I'll try. Because they don't make they the um, the cartridges for my printer are hard to find, and when you do find them, they're like they're like um I think like thirty five for a black and white and sixty for a color. I can't remember, but it's obnoxious, and I desperately need my printer for. Uh, printing postage and other stuff, so gotta fix, gotta get that going, gotta get fixed up. So I got one more package, and I'm going to pause it and start another video because I know this one's going to start skipping, and I don't want that to happen in the middle of this. So we will be back. All right, got that done. Got that done and handled. Anyway, I went ahead and opened that, that last package so I could organize it without taking too much time. So, um, since it's in 18 pieces, I can't hold it up to show you, so I will do it one at a time. There's one, two, three, four, five batches. So, 
we'll do the first one. I got um five sets of um buttons, pins, whatever you want to call them. A little smaller than I thought they would be, but they're still pretty cool nonetheless. And they're all horror related. And um, I got them. I think they were three fifty, three seventy, close to four dollars. And they had a best offer option, so I put in for two seventy five for each set, and I got them. So, and I plan on getting some more too. So the first set, there's three. And they are, like I said, they're all horror related. And um, this one was done in NES colors. The first one is like some kind of pinhead Jason mashup. And got it. Oh, good, you didn't turn the back. It's okay. Then you got this Friday the 13th. Sorry about the glare. I know the quality is bad. I was hoping for that tri that tripod to come. But I will I will take pictures of it and put it at the end of this video. And then there's one more. Oh, where are you? Ah! Uh. See if I can do something about this glare coming from my window. And that was Jason. Those were the NES colors. So the next set I have. I can't turn that one very good. The next set is Army of Darkness. Sorry, it's so hard to see. Oh. These are very cool. And out of the three of the Army of Darkness, this is my favorite. Ash. <coughs> Then, this one will tell you what the next set of three are. Oh, uh, go on, stop glare. But like I said, I'll get pictures of these. <clears throat> I love that one. Then, oh god, oh cramp in my leg. Then the other three are Nightmare on Elm Street. That one's very hard to see, but I got all these to put on my Misfits uh, band um messenger bag. Since I can't wear my Misfits cap because it's a winter cap. There we go. And I really, really like this one. Alright. <clears throat> Last set. And this one has six. And I just watched the second one of these the other night. I prefer the first one, but. The second one's really good too, and I hated the third one. But it is Creep Show. I saw these and I had to have them. It's one of my, those two are like my favorite, one of my favorite uh, set of horror films. And I don't really hate the last one. I just, I don't know. It took me a long time to like the second one, but. I love the creep show films.
These are so little. I'll pull it back. It says George Romero on it. <clears throat> and last one. Which is a very famous quick show picture. Yep, so that is my 18 button pins. 17! <laughs> well, dropping them all over the place. Well, I'm doing it again, but handful there, handful there. So I plan on ordering some more <laughs> next month. Found a new addiction. I used to collect buttons when I was a, when I was a kid, and then again as a teenager when I hung out with a lot of bands, especially like the the hair bands. So, and I still have some of those from my my teen years. So. That was our haul for today. We've got, um, <coughs> we've got, um, Horror Block coming. It, Horror Block is so incredibly late this month compared to when I usually get it. Um, it, they switched to UPS and also something about some of their shirts for Horror Block and Arcade Block came back and the colors were off, so they had to reprint the shirts again. So those two issues are making them a little late. Um, not a big deal, but I'm just impatient. And let's see what else do we have? Uh, Comet Bento came the other day, but I haven't posted a video yet. Um, oh, my Geek Fuel. They finally figured out where my geek fuel was. I hadn't even left yet. The girl that uh, was responsible for sending me my, my box never sent it. She set it up to be sent, but it, it never got sent. So they sorted that out. And I am what sure. No, I'm not sure what else I have coming. Oh! My two Star Wars Greedos Funko Pops are in it. Well, they were in Atlanta. They are now here in Cobb County. So, they said it'll be another couple days before I get them, but they're right up the street. Yep. My Greedo and my Horror Block and my Geek Fuel. That's what I got left coming. And, oh, and I guess we're getting our Cowabunga collectible geek caches and everything in about a week or so. And then by then it'll be time for all the, all the May boxes to start coming in. So, yep, yep, that's about it. So, we're out of here. He's still exhausted. He's so he's so sick. Monday, poor thing. He's exhausted. I'm exhausted because I've had no sleep worrying. So they've been walked. So it's time for them to have dinner in a bit. Time for me to have dinner in a bit. No more conking out early. So, that's it. We will see you guys whenever we get some more goodies, which may be in a, uh, in a day or two. So, see you guys. Peace out.